All right, Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bashim Al Shai, Wabar Chakwadash, which Yahweh is the Heavenly Father's true name. Yahweh Shai is from the world, ignorantly calls Jesus Christ, that's his true name. And Rakhakwadash is the Holy Spirit. And I'm also going to give double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who ruin teach all the scriptures. And salutations to all the brothers out there who are pushing this word in all truth and in all sincerity. And in this lesson, I just want to talk about how Sleazy E, he um, will cut your live stream video short, okay? And this video that I made here with the uh, elder brother Lahab, which is entitled um, Impromptu, where at the end keep fighting. This video was a live stream. And it was about, I would say, 30 to 35 minutes long. And as you can see, it says here that the video now is only 15 minutes and 12 seconds. And this is not the first time that Esau has done one of this, you know, has done this to one of my live streams. Okay. And I'm not the only brother as well. Um, there's been other brothers, you know, in uh, the Chicago camp. They also said that their video, all right, was cut short. You know, and this is just a way for Esau to, you know, hinder the word. All right. You know, instead of, you know, actually giving you a strike or terminating your page, he'll do something like this. Also, what he's done, too, as well. Um, Elder Melkma out here in Chicago has said that um, he's gotten comments. And this was a couple years back, too. He said that he's had comments, you know, on his comment board saying that particular videos were removed. And when he went to search for those videos that the um you know that the brothers were talking about, he couldn't find them. Okay? You know, Esau is just doing, you know, very slick things. You know, he wants to stop this word because this truth is bringing down his kingdom. You know, this kingdom that he has built up was built on lies, okay, and established on lies. And since this truth is going forth at such a high rate, He's trying to do anything in his power to stop it because he doesn't want his kingdom to fall and collapse. And this is what's destroying his kingdom, the word of Yahweh Bashim Shai. Okay? But as the scriptures say here, in Isaiah 55 and 11, it says, So shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void, but it shall accomplish that which I please, and it shall prosper in the thing whereto I sent it. So this word is getting pushed. And it's it, it's um it's not going to return unto the Lord, okay? A uh, void. It's going to accomplish, okay? You know that which uh, the uh, as it says, but it shall accomplish which I please, and it shall prosper, okay? You see, these things are going to prosper. They're going to be accomplished. You know, no matter what Esau tries to do, as the uh, scriptures say. Here in uh, what is that uh, what is that second second Corinthians? You know what, let me just type it in. It says, um, where is it? Uh, where? It says, um, it says you could do nothing against the truth, okay? Let's get that scripture real quick. Um, where, where is it at? Uh, right here. This is, um, 2 Corinthians 13 and 8. For we can do nothing against the truth before the truth. So no matter what Esau tries to do, whether he leaves our videos alone or whether he tries to eliminate the videos, it, it, it's all going to fulfill prophecy, okay? So if they leave the videos up, the elect are going to hear the word, they're going to be sealed, and that fulfills prophecy. And if they clip our videos, then the prophecy of Amos... The, um, what is that? The 8 and 11 comes to pass. The famine of the word. Okay. So no matter what this guy does. He's fulfilling what Yahweh Bashim al wants him to do. Okay. He's fighting a losing battle right now. And that's why he's scrambling. That's why he's, uh, um, getting mad. All right. He, he, he's scared. And the only thing that he can do very soon is. You know, ultimately what? He's going to clip the internet and then he's going to come down with that great wrath, which he's going to fulfill prophecy. You know, he's just going to get carnal because that's all he knows. He doesn't know how to stay spiritual. All right. You know, but, you know, pretty much, you know, that's all I wanted to, you know, highlight how, um, 
you know, this guy, you know, he's trying to, you know, stop this word. You know, so I can, you know, just, you know, pay attention to your videos and, you know, don't get really upset if this guy's, you know, he's, you know, uh, you know, uh, shorting, uh, shortening your videos, you know, or clipping them, uh, clipping them without you knowing, all right, giving you strikes, terminating your page, and you know, it is what it is, you know, hey, look, we're not gonna uh, be preaching forever, you know, you gotta remember that at some point the Lord's gonna stop this word from going out, you know, because hey, the word of the Lord is gonna be precious, you know, as it as it um, speaks about in the Book of Samuel, it talks about how the the words of the Lord were precious in those days. And those times are coming up again. You know, and then it's going to get um, that prophecy in Matthew, the 25th chapter is going to be fulfilled. Where it talks about the five wise virgin, uh, virgins and it talks about the five foolish virgins. Okay, you see, not everyone's going to have that oil. And it's supposed to be like that. You know, the elect, that remnant is going to have the oil. All right. And the two thirds, they're not going to have that oil. You know, they're going to lack that oil and they're going to um, perish because they don't have oil. You see, we're going to be okay because we have the oil. All right. And um, that's pretty much it, Akim. You know, so, hey, just keep pushing, keep fighting. You know, don't let uh, these things distract you. You know, we're almost out of here. And with that, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to you, Bashim al Shai. Also, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone and salutations to all the brothers out there. Shalom.